Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Bailey and today I have a, such a fun video for you guys. I cannot wait. I have spent the last couple days of my life just vlogging all of the fun experiences that I've been having and I continue to vlog over the next couple of days all of the fun experiences that... It, oh my god, I cannot do this today. All of the fun experiences that I have over the next couple of days. I just want to create like a full birthday week in my life vlog for you guys because I have been having so much fun and I have so much more more fun stuff planned and I just want to share it with all of you guys because I just I, I love you okay <laughs> yesterday was my actual birthday and literally all I did was drive home three and a half hours from Chicago and watch four episodes of Outer Banks I was actually in Chicago with one of my best friends and her family because we went to the SZA concert and I can't even put into words how amazing that experience was it was the craziest most surreal it was crazy. I don't think that I can ever go to another concert because of how amazing it was. Like nothing will ever top this concert, you guys. I also was in the second row, like stage here, me here, SZA 10 feet away from me. Like I was just like this the whole time. It was crazy. I do have a bunch of footage from like getting ready for the concert, going to the concert, vlogging footage of the concert. And I will share that with you guys in a little bit, but I kind of want to share with you guys like what led up to that point because I did a lot of fun stuff in Chicago before the actual concert. So we got to Chicago on Tuesday and I think it was around like 4 p.m. when we actually like got to our hotel We checked into the hotel my friend's mom had a pizza waiting for us there and we were all starving So that was amazing of her. We got all of our stuff situated We kind of unpacked and then we changed did our makeup and headed out onto the town We had dinner reservations at like 7 I believe but we spent like two hours kind of just like walking around the city and shopping But not really shopping because none of us were buying anything. We were just browsing Saying, you know just walking around the town what you do in Chicago basically I barely have any footage at all because my phone died the second that we got to dinner the restaurant was so nice the food was so good there was like live music and they sang happy birthday to me and the restaurant had a happy birthday card waiting for me but the next day I did get more footage we went shopping pretty much all day I got so much stuff we all spent like hundreds of dollars in Aritzia which was so great so great oh my god i'm gonna do a haul in this video of all the stuff that i bought myself for my birthday like girl you have gotten yourself enough stop shopping i literally just got back like i just went to sephora and bought like stop shopping in chicago is just so fun all of the stores are so big and there's so much stuff and it's so overwhelming and fun and it's just like you need to spend money when you're in Chicago, you know what I mean? But unfortunately, all the shopping had to come to an end because we realized that we needed to get back to the hotel in order to have enough time to get ready for the concert. <laughs> Guys, I'm so f***ing excited. <laughs> Okay, I have not picked up my camera once, but we are ready for the SZA concert and we are about to go. I got ready, or we got ready, and then we went down and we ate a few little like appetizer things with her parents. And then now our driver is gonna be here soon. But here's the outfit. This little corset top from Princess Polly. These cargoes, puffer. Here's Angie's fit, doesn't she look here's so fit. cute? So cute, the I love, shoes. I love. Look at her makeup. Yeah, yeah, we are kind of in a hurry, but I'm gonna bring my phone and I'm gonna try to get as much footage as possible But I can't make any promises because I'm gonna be Tweaking out the whole time <laughs> <laughs> That was actually the best catch of my life Guys, I'm so proud of myself. Look at this I love you feel like the, the lighting is so weird. weird. I'm like my heart is beating so fast <laughs> Woo! Going to say Cesa Okay, this cannot go the phone. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna live in one of the high rides? I, 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 I live by what is it, uh, White Sox mm. Okay, yeah. That's nice for Ubering because yeah, really there's so many people in the city that need rides. Yeah. And oh, then yeah. you're right there. Oh my god. I'm tweaking. How are you feeling guys? Please I have that hot. I you look I we're literally goodying and it was a gas. Yes. Yes. 
Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Sorry. <laughs> He's literally quitting me. What is this account? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I cannot contain my excitement right now. I'm going to piss myself. I don't even need to pee. Okay, I'm buying some merch. Probably shouldn't spend any more money, but we're going to. I'm gonna get that shirt. Can't see I'm blind. I can't see anything. I can't see. I'm blind. We're in this. Stop. Second row. Stop. I'm crying. I'm about to start crying. <laughs> She's gonna be right. Right, right, right. Sorry. No way. There's literally no way. I knew we were gonna be close, but like right there. <laughs> Crazy. How do you feel? I'm so excited. We're gonna cry and piss our pants. <laughs> Yay, we were Approve for done. entry, beach. Approve for entry. Like I don't have any words like I feel like I don't even need to wrap any of like like it was great It was amazing. We hired our uber driver from earlier in the day to be like our private driver And he literally like sat and waited for us the entire concert so that when the concert was over We walked out we were like the first people to get like a ride and he was like the first car in the front row of like the uber pickup area the next day we woke up and we got breakfast at this amazing breakfast place I got chicken and waffles and bro. It was the best chicken and waffles I've ever had do not sleep on chicken and waffles I don't care if you've never had it I don't like don't knock it till you try it but yeah then we drove home and that leads us to now basically because yesterday I didn't do anything after I got home I woke up this morning at like 9 a.m. and I felt like crap because I'm on my period right now obviously I'm on my period the week of my birthday like why but I woke up my cramps were terrible so I just went back to bed and I didn't reset any alarms so I woke up at 11 30 and realized that I had plans for breakfast brunch with my best friend at 11. I felt so bad because we literally had these plans and I like slept through them so I just started rushing to get ready and stuff and I'll show that footage now of me like getting ready and then going to lunch and everything because that is pretty much the last thing that I did. After a very long, exhausting morning of me rushing to get ready, Ryan is here to pick me up. Look at this. This is so insane. Hey, girl. Okay, here's our food. I got a little BLT thing, fries. Ryan got the same thing with soup. 18. They're fire, so good. We just got lunch. It was pretty good. Um, how did you feel? <laughs> how did you enjoy your food? I really like it a lot. Okay, we're going to Sephora right now because I want my free birthday gift. And I also have a $50 gift card from Christmas that I haven't spent. And I need my milk contour 
little stick thing. Whoa! So yeah, I just got back from lunch in the mall just a second ago. I think I'm gonna do a haul of everything that I bought while I was in Chicago and then also what my mom got me for my birthday, like some of it, and then what I got today when I went to Sephora. So like I said, while I was in Chicago, I spent a lot of money at Aritzia. I'm gonna show all of this really quick, but maybe you guys care, so let's get into it. The first thing that I got is this little white tank top. It's called the Momo Sculpt Knit. I don't know. It's super adorable. It kind of has like a corset type of vibe because it has like these lines down it, but it's not like wired or anything. It's very comfortable. If you guys can see the shape of it, it is literally like hourglass and very like, it's stretchy, but it's also like really tight. Hence the word sculpt in the name of it. This thing, I put it on my body and I just <laughs> snatched. Snatched, snatched, snatched. I recommend this tank top so much. It is so cute and flattering. The next one I got is also a corset type of vibe. This is the Natalie sleeveless top. It's just a little black tank top and it has like the corset looking lines in it. If you can see there, probably not. Again, super flattering. All of Aritzia's clothing is just so flattering. I also got this tank top. It's just this cream little ribbed tank. I have been looking for just like nice basic staple tank tank tops and this one is like my favorite ever because it's like a thicker material and it's also really supportive like I don't need to wear a bra with it I got these gray little cargo sweat shorts aren't these the cutest things ever and then I got this this is called the contour tank and it's just a basic black bodysuit and then the star of the show what everybody in that Aritzia was trying to get me to buy like my friend was trying to get me to buy this my friend's mom was trying to get me to buy this all of the employees were trying to sell me this faux leather chocolate brown skirt it is so cute i don't know i don't really have a lot of skirts and i figured that this could be like a good staple piece for me and then we went to abercrombie i have not gotten anything from abercrombie since i was literally like 12 years old i don't know why because i walked in there and they had so many cute things but i just got this pair of jean shorts thought they were super cute and i needed a new pair they're the mom short curve love high rise i don't know and then the last clothing store i went to in chicago was urban outfitters or not the last store but like the last store that i got something from i got this little cream knit zip up i literally saw this hanging i was like that is the cutest thing i've ever seen i need it right now this is just so freaking cute it's so soft it's cropped it has like some little like distressing at the bottom here i don't even know how to describe it but i just saw this thought it was super cute tried it on and it looked great the next thing i got is a little corset top i literally saw it made eye contact with it and was like yes i need that one it's just like a little halter top corset in the prettiest green color ever the back like laces up and there's a zipper in the front like it is it is so so cute literally look how pretty that is and it fit great i i love it at this is a concert i had to get merch obviously so i got this open arms t-shirt honestly sizzle you could have done a lot better with your merch i don't even want to like come at her like that but everybody that i heard talking about it was a little bit disappointed this was honestly the only cute thing that i that i saw like everything was just kind of eh. but little oversized t-shirt just for like sleeping in hanging out in there's a compass on the back super cool i just obviously had to get a shirt we waited in line so long for this not just for me in particular like my friend and her sister also got something then today at sephora i got my little birthday gift obviously it's this brand alia i've never heard of it there's a mini mascara and and then a multi stick, a multi stick. I think it's like a lip and a blush, like cream product that you can use. And then I had to restock on my milk bronzer stick, which I want to make sure that this is the right color because I was going back and forth between two different colors. I think it's this one, but we'll see. And then I have been so into like fragrance. Fra fragrances lately like I love perfume all of a sudden like I've always liked perfume but lately I just want to keep buying perfumes I'm sure you guys have heard of this brand or maybe not but I have just seen it popping into my life so much recently it's the replica brand um by Mason Margiela Mar Margiela 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 I don't know this is the scent beach walk and it, it literally smells like heaven on earth like it literally smells like the beach like if you walked into a beach store on the beach like that's what this smells like it is so good then we have some of the stuff that my mom got me me and my mom are going to get tattoos later this week hopefully if we can get appointments she got me this adorable sweatshirt from hollister there's just like mushrooms on it and it says you are your wait what does it say you're part of it all the way of the universe 
I don't know. I love mushrooms. I don't take my <laughs> I love the look of like mushrooms on stuff like groovy like you know the vibe there's mushrooms all over my phone case my debit card is in there but there's mushrooms on my phone case I don't eat mushrooms like if there's mushrooms in the food that I order I like pick around them I cannot stand mushrooms and then I also don't like eat mushrooms if you know what I mean but I like how mushrooms look I think they're very cute so she got me this sweatshirt it is so freaking soft I love it she got me some little like chocolate things and then she got me two jewelry items these little coach earrings which I think are so freaking adorable I love like dainty dangly earrings if that makes sense like I don't like huge dangly earrings unless they're hoops for the most part but like little like I love these I also need more silver jewelry so she got me those and then she got me this bracelet and this is from Zales jewelry store. It's just this silver bracelet with amethyst in it. Um, it's one of these like things. I don't know. I love this though. <laughs> but yeah, like my big gift from her this year is my tattoo because we're getting matching tattoos and obviously I'm gonna vlog that. Hopefully we can get it done this week. Otherwise it might not be in this vlog. Okay, you guys, it's been about an hour. I'm literally about to take off all my makeup because I absolutely hate my makeup right now. I rushed to do it this morning and I just did not do my best work and I want to look slay i want to look slay for dinner me and my boyfriend decided on dinner tonight at seven i believe he made the reservation for i have no idea where we're going he told me to dress nice but i don't know if that's like dress nice like like wear a dress or if that's like a sweater and jeans vibe or like what what the vibe is so we're gonna have to figure that out i really quickly wanted to show you guys my room though because i forgot to mention this when i got home from chicago yesterday my room was decorated my best friend ryan who i went to lunch with today came over while i was gone and she like did this there's like some happy birthday banners and like this 18 balloon and some heart balloons on my bed Balloons up there another banner. I don't know why I start talking like this all the time, but so cute, right? Okay, for some reason I thought I had way more time than I did I didn't end up redoing all my makeup, but I just like reapplied my blonde Bronzer and blush and highlight and like curled my eyelashes and like put a little bit more mascara on here She is here. She is here's the outfit. I'm wearing my new top from Aritzia super cute I really just love how it fits. It just like fits my waist and stuff perfectly and it looks great with low rise So I just have these low rise light wash jeans on with these boots. I feel like this is a very like Standard dinner outfit like nice dinner outfit. Um, I was gonna wear a dress But it's literally like seven degrees out right now and I cannot have my legs exposed I kind of wanted to do my hair, but I do not have oh, I do not have time for that. Hi guys, I am very sorry to end the video like this. I hate doing this, like I hate just popping in and filming an outro like after the fact, but I'm just overall not incredibly happy with the video that this is turned into. I do like it, I think it was fun and I liked vlogging like the whole concert thing in like Chicago, but I just feel like I didn't get adequate footage, like I didn't get enough footage of everything that I was doing. And then also two of like the main things that I wanted to do in this video was get my matching tattoo with my mom and then also get matching bracelets like the permanent bracelets with my best friend we actually went and got it yesterday this is just like a thin little gold chain and they like weld it on to you um so it's permanent which is really cool um this was like her gift to me this year i really like it i didn't vlog yesterday though because it's actually been like a week and a half since the rest of this video was filmed it's literally like march like March 3rd or the 4th I don't even know anyways I'm ending off the video thank you so so much for watching I love you also thank you for all the birthday wishes over on my Instagram and my TikTok and in the comments on my YouTube videos I really appreciate you guys in case you don't already know I did start a podcast it's called things could be worse and it's available on Spotify Apple Podcasts, and visually on YouTube at the things could be worse YouTube channel I had a bunch of fun for my birthday this year it was it was a really good birthday I love you guys and I will see you next time bye bye